is Dark, and welcome back to Layers of Fear. Last time we left off, well, there is no really last time, it's more like a layer of fear, so last we left off, we were on the first layer, now we're on the second layer. This is what we did last time. Skin. Right? He used the razor to cut off the skin, or whatever. <coughs> Alright. We read all these last time, I'm pretty sure. Yeah. Shapeless dreams. All right, so layer two. Here we go. <clears throat> hmm. There's that picture again, but that picture is like slightly different. It looks like it's my face now. Huh. Hold on. Here we go. Up. Oh, did I go the wrong direction? Um. Oh, I didn't see what that said. Should I have gone the other direction? Can I go the other direction? No, it'll only let you go one direction with these levers. Okay. <clears throat> Alright, well, let's see what there is to see. Bunch of nothing here. Locked doors, naturally. Don't mind me, I'm just dying. These are all locked doors. Huh. Oh, you. Ooh, that's good. It's good. I like that. I'll take this key for something. Dear sir, while I can certainly understand that you are upset and I have nothing but sympathy for your wife and yourself, I must categorically state that I do not wish to receive any further correspondence from you in this matter. Any skin for any sorry, any skin graft procedure is extremely complicated and inherently associated with the risk of failure. Uh, <clears throat> having stated that, I assure you that me and my colleagues at St. Anne have made every effort to ensure a positive outcome for your wife. Oh, Personally speaking, I believe we have done the best job possible considering the extent of tissue damage. You are, of course, entitled to your opinion, and I can certainly understand your disappointment. What I do not understand is how you seem to think writing hateful letters to me or my fellow doctors will ameliorate... Will, um, uh, I can't read. Will ameliorate the situation. As I've told you, as I've already stated, I can under, certainly understand you've been under a lot of stress as of late, and thus I will not press charges if you refrain from any for future correspondence. Let me make it absolutely clear that I will not tolerate any further threats aimed at my staff, my family, or myself. If you wish to seek psychological help, I can have my assistant provide contact information for several specialists who would be more than competent to help you get through these hard times. With regards and best wishes for you and your wife, William H. Great MD. Bill. <clears throat> Oops. What? Why did you stop? The doom was perfect. Honey, please, just a little longer. At least until I finish painting this one part. Oh, don't make me beg. Hmm. It's a trio, is it? What happens if I just close the door? Oh. Oh, is that because she got burned? Huh, okay, well. Locked still? Uh, nothing in here? 
Well, I guess that key goes to this door. Or oh, yes, we will find out. Huh. Those are sneaky. They look like part of the walls. <coughs> I'll find out what that is in a second. I'm sure I don't want to know. Let's, uh... So it's locked. Whatever's in there is locked. Is that her piano? Is that the fire she was in? I'm trying to get a better view of like what's exactly happened here. Huh. Okay, well, um Ah Well uh, let's go this way I guess. Anything back here? No? Okay. It's dark. It's dark up here. I don't like it. I don't like those demon noises. Where are they coming from? Oh. Good. It's lovely. Mm, that scared the ever-loving fuck out of me. Hmm. Okay, we're good. Well, before I go back, oh, let's see what else is in here. Anything in the bucket? No, okay. I just want to be absolutely sure I'm not missing anything. But of course, there's always going to be a chance that I miss something, because it feels like you can't get absolutely everything in this game unless you really look. Oh, hey, what's this? Warning signs. The following list is a compilation of the most common symptoms of schizophrenia, while typically diagnosed between the ages of 15 and 25. Huh. The disorder is known to affect older patients as well. Note that these symptoms are not exclusive to schizophrenia and should by no means be treated as conclusive evidence of this particular affliction. In order to obtain a proper diagnosis, you should contract, contact a qualified specialist, i.e. psychologist, psychiatrist. Blank expression stares off into space, involuntary movement, Facial movements, yes, yes. Insomnia, haven't noticed. Unusual gestures or postures, always had that. Unable to experience joy from activities, definitely. Depersonalization, what does that even mean? Awkward, clumsy movement, might be from the accident. Uh, prone to anger, resentment, more passive-aggressive. Lack of motivation, yes. Suicidal tendencies, da-da-da-da-da-da. Ah, ra 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 I saw that. Happens to gloss right over the mouse trap, you little sneak. Okay, well, there's nothing over there. At least that I could see. Uh, this door got ripped off its hinges. <laughs> make up your mind. Oh, make up your mind. That dude, that dude's very brother looking, too. <clears throat> Uh, ba, ba, ha, ba, ma, ma, na, ma, na, ma, na, ma, na, ma, na, ba, 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 na, ba. Fancy. I don't want to be back in these rooms. These rooms scare me. <laughs> uh, these rooms are spooky. Spooky, scary skeletons. You know, those skeletons of the spooky, scary kind. Uh, la 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 la. Anything in here? Nope. That's horrifying. It is so dark, I cannot see anything in here. <clears throat> Okay, I don't think there's anything specifically interesting in this room. Mm. 
you stay over there. <sighs> Was waiting for the door to close. Oh. What did I just see? I missed it. What did I see? What did I not see? I don't know. I'm gonna look around again. What if there's something changed? What if there's something new? Ah, 729. Okay, 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 okay. 729, 729, 729. 729. Oop. 729. 729. All right. Let's check. All right. Um, oops. Uh... Seven two nine. Well, that's not it. Okay, we'll figure that out. We'll figure that out in a sec. <clears throat> I'm sure. Uh, but there was the ju there was the dates with the uh, 10.09.02 or whatever whatever that one was called. Oh, I can actually, like, turn on lamps now. Sick. Um, alright. There's gotta be... There has to be, uh, some sort of combination for that. Right? Is it gonna lock me out if I leave this room? Is the combination in this hallway? <clears throat> Somewhere? I mean, I don't know. But... I don't know if I should be behind going behind that door. Should I just Google it? <laughs> uh, I don't know. I'm gonna Google it. Yeah, I'm a cheater. <clears throat> Oops. Okay, so it's counterclockwise, clockwise, counterclockwise. Counterclockwise, uh, that's clockwise. Seven, two, nine. Okay, let me try this again. Oop, backwards. Okay, I'm gonna try this. <coughs> Seven. Right? Two. Nine. Uh, okay, hold on. That's the piece of paper that it gave me, so... Maybe, hold on, maybe I have to do it just once. So, like, seven. Hold on. Damn it, did it again. Seven, two, nine. That didn't work. Okay. Seven, 
to nine. It's not freaking. <clears throat> Seven two nine. What am I doing wrong? Seventy twenty ninety. Uh, enter. E fucking Q F <clears throat> Oh gosh, okay. <clears throat> Let me try this. Hold on. That's backwards. Seven, two, nine. Oh my god. Okay. That's all I had to do. Okay. It was clockwise first, not counterclockwise. So the directions are randomized. Just like the numbers. Also, I have a key now. A key to a door. I assume, right? This door out here? I don't know, I didn't get that far. <clears throat> this door. Oh! March 26th. Alright, let's try this again. Finally managed to play a little. If banging on the keys awkwardly counts as playing. I won't lie, it drives me insane. That's not to not have full control of my fingers. In any case, I was promptly berated by my loving husband who said I should be resting. I know he means well, but how will I ever get better if I don't work at it? The worst thing is I could smell, I swear I could swear I smelled liquor on his breath. God, please, not this again. Oh, we're getting a picture. We're getting a picture picture of the artist not of the sitter huh yeah this clock this clock is ticking why is this clock ticking well I'm not gonna read too much into it <laughs> <coughs> Yeah, I don't think there's anything in there. Sorry for my janky freaking mouse movements. Uh, okay. Into the room of Globe. Hello, Globe. What are these? I've been seeing these everywhere. What are these? Whoa. Whoa. It cannot be undone. It cannot undone cannot be undone whoa whoa dude what is that oh that's the globe the center of the globe is the light Oh, it is the opposite, because over there, I think, is the cigarettes, and over here are the matches. Huh. Wow. This game is impressive. Don't like the sound of that. Morph. Hello, doggies. Oh, oh, the doggy. 
Oh, that's so sad. My heart, it beats for these doggies. Good boy. Honey, honey, remember how you said it would be nice to have a cat so the baby could have someone to play with? Well, I just bought us a dog. <laughs> oh. I don't think she liked the dog. You want this as well? No, not particularly. I wouldn't say that this is particularly enjoyable. Arrgh. No, this is fun, but I wouldn't want this. A once great artist, Blank's new painting, laughed out of galleries. What we witnessed today, while entirely worthless can, in artistic terms, might, it might be an invaluable case study for psychologists. These harsh words came from none other than Jason Hughes. The famed critic was one of the first to appreciate the works of Blank, and whose praise once, con once contributed to his first spectacular success. When asked if such brutal criticism was indeed called for, especially in light of the recent tragic events, Hughes responded, As critics, it is our duty to critique art, but not to, ju not to judge the artist. The man has been through a lot lately, and obviously it has taken its toll on him. Still, if we were to remain silent and pretend this is even remotely acceptable, we would be doing the artist a disservice. Other critics were only slightly more lenient as the blank. Well, I can see you don't like my art. I will take it elsewhere. That's fine by me. I'll put it in another museum. I'll put it in another museum. Uh. Uh. I can't get. I can't push the wheelchair. That scared the absolute hell out of me. <clears throat> um. Okay. I don't know what to do about that. I guess nothing. We're doing nothing about that. Nothing in there. Uh, Mr. Washington. Hello, uh, Mr. Washington. Something about those long, mysterious hallway, it doesn't, doesn't seem like it's going to call out to me very much, but, ugh, whatever. I guess I'll just do it. Thought I heard whispering again. Maybe I'm going crazy. Ew. No thanks. Uh... Uh, we're here. What? Did I do something wrong? Huh. Maybe not. Okay, so I have a choice. Do I think of my wife or do I think of myself in my spiral? Mm, wonder what this door does. All these pictures are small, by the way. Uh, okay, so I have to do this. <clears throat> uh, well, it's over here. The exact same thing, I'm pretty sure. Just on a mirrored image. Yeah. Uh, so should I choose myself or should I choose my wife? Should I worry about fixing her and making her perfect or should I worry about making my art perfect?
Mm, I'm gonna do this one. I feel like a dick for doing that. But. Ah, great. Just gonna use the old clicker here. Yeah, take that. Spooky scaries. I have I have ways around your spooks. What is this? September 12th. She's been at it again. Earlier in the day, I found more of her reviews. Little notes stuck to one of my latest paintings. Some of the most scathing, hateful shit I've ever read about my work. I guess I shouldn't be surprised. After all, she knows me well enough to know what really gets to me. I just can't believe she would do use that against me. Worst, worst thing is, when I confronted her about it, she claimed she hadn't written any of them. Like, I can't really tell her handwriting. Jesus. Does she really hate me that much, or is her mind starting to slip? I just don't know what to do anymore. Hmm, interesting. So one of them <coughs> is a liar. I almost died. <laughs> Did you hear a cat just now? I thought I heard a meow. Okay, well, I guess not. I don't like this dark corridor. It's spooky. I have to get out of here. Oh, I like this even less. What? What? what uh, God, blah, 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 blah. I don't like this. <laughs> hmm. Mm-mm. Mm -mm -mm. The storm just won't seem to... What? What? What was that? Fuck off. Sorry. <laughs> nothing in here. Uh, nothing in here. Ah, picture. Uh, they're all scratched out. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh, I'm stuck. Quick, turn the lights back on. Where's the other light? Oh, God. April 6th found his collection of empty bottles this morning. I reacted badly. I know it's hard for him, too, but God damn it, he should know better. With a small child in the house, it's just irresponsible. That's got to be him. Because he has the limp. And I have the limp, too. Hmm. Okay. Uh, key. Key to what? Couldn't tell you. That's nice. Oh, that's lovely. Oh, fucking great. This house is absolutely amazing. But those stairs. With that leg of mine, I think you'll have to carry me to the bedroom once we move in. Just <laughs> key go to this door? No. Couldn't hurt to check. Well, we'll we'll hold on to this key then until we find what it unlocks. Anything in here? Nope. A whole lot of nothing. Oh, this uh, key unlocks this door. Fancy. <coughs> oh. 
Oh, hey, what? Unleash your inner beauty with the new Glamour Glamour Fusion Max. Say farewell to acne scars, enlarged pores, and other unpleasant skin conditions. The new Glamour Fusion Max concealer will give your skin a healthier look and a smoother feel. Don't think of it as covering up your deficiencies. Think of it as unleashing your inner beauty. But really, you're covering up your deficiencies. That's why they're saying, don't think of it like that. Think of it like this. Right? It's because they're calling makeup because it's called it's making up for your flaws. Honey, what in the world are you doing? What did the doctor say about straining yourself? Leave that thing alone. It's not going anywhere. I want to learn how to play the violin. That'd be sick. Good model, too. There's actually space between the strings. Oh, we're in the bedroom now. Okay. Maybe... Just making sure. Prosthesis, snatchers, insatiable bastards, can't afford a new one. Why the damn leg? Box. Uh, anything in the bedside drawers? I don't think so. There's a record over there. I can only imagine what I'm supposed to do with that. Uh, but... Sorry. had dreams like this where the room melts all around me plastic tubing I siphoned gas before I knew how it was done I stuck the tube in a vein and sucked on it until blood filled my mouth then put the tube in the jar and it just kept coming the taste of copper haunted me the entire night why didn't I think of a syringe Sounds like you're a you problem to me, sir. Okay. Oh, I can't leave. Just making sure nothing nothing else changed. You never know. <laughs> ah, what did that do? What does this do? Something here and there, and they must declare. Did I do it? I think I did it. Heck yeah, dude. Oh, send chapter two. Alrighty, Rudy. Sick. I hear other things, so we're gonna look around first before we end this chapter. I can't stand seeing you like this. You're not well. You were sweating and shaking all night, and now there you are, locked in your workshop, as usual. The whole tortured artist nonsense has got to stop. Hmm. I'm starting to think that you weren't meant to complete this on one playthrough. Form emerges, eh? Does it truly emerge? 
hate even now, lost alone. You deserve it. A grave for you. Finish it. We'll not do that yet. We was going to check if anything is in here. I know I'm stalling. Just give me one second. Looking for anything. Okay. Cool. Some liquid courage for a grand art. Did his voice actor change? Some liquid courage for your grand art opening. Nice. Well, I guess we're on to chapter three. Ew. Looks like Shrek's swamp. That's nasty. Uh, anything else has changed here? I don't think so. But uh, yeah, this is where we're going to leave the episode here this time, I think. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed it, please like, subscribe, share, and do all that fun shit. It really helps. And as always, I will see y'all in the next video. Later.